Yeah, you guys are getting me in trouble here with Mrs. Brickitect. I asked her this week to stop by the post office for me and pick up a few packages. This is what she came out with, and she's like, I had to make mobile trips out to the car. And this package right here, which was hyped up from our last Letter Attack episode, if you saw it. I know exactly what's in here. <gasps> I'm ready. You're just trying to make those things fall, aren't you? Yeah, okay. <laughs> are you back there? Yeah. Whoa. Ah! <laughs> All right, Clarky. This one I saved just for you, okay? Okay. This is a very special one for the Clark man, and they've been waiting for a long time for you to open is, this up. Is there a toy inside? I think there may be. You want to see what's in there? <gasps> Mini! That is right. <laughs> Let's bring him in here, Clark man. Can you guess which one this is? Um, Victor. Victor. Okay. We're going to test Clark man's X Man abilities. If this really is Victor, I'm going to freak out. Who is that guy? Spencer! Close enough, right? So we got Spencer. Here's your little thing if you want to study all of the other characters. I almost opened this up during Letter Attack and... Oh, Daddy! <laughs> we got this one! Are we going to play the We Got This One game with Thomas Minis? <laughs> yeah, we got this one right here. I'm trying to think of how many Thomas Minis I've actually purchased versus how many we have. I think almost like 99% of the collection has come from you guys, oh, which we really appreciate. Here's a little close-up on... Spencer. This is going to be a super long mail time, so I'm going to read the letter here while you're looking at that, okay? It says, Dear Greg and Clark, I hope you are both well. Myself, hubby, and our four-year-old have been watching both your channels since the beginning of the year, and our Lego collection has grown immensely because of this. We love watching your videos, and we can see the similarities between Clark and our son Matthew. It's quite amusing. When I saw you had been collecting the Lego cards for the Sainsbury's book, I looked through my duplicates and found two that you didn't have, so I enclosed them for you, number 37 and 87. I have included a wee thing for Clark Man as well, which you got into. What's up? I know what's that one's one name is, Daddy. What's it, his name? It's Fire Flynn with bananas on his side. Cool. I think the cards are in here. It says, take care from Claire, Chris, and Matthew from Scotland. Mm. They're from Scotland, Clarky. Inside here, we've got two of the elusive cards that have not been in our collection. There we go. We're going to add those to the book, my friends. Thank yeah. you for that. And thank you for your patience in opening this up. I think it was worth it waiting for the Clark man to get his mini. All right, dude. Wow. All right, we've got another package here. This one is also from the UK. I'm telling you, UK okay. people. From the UK. I'll bring you guys out so you guys can see what comes out of here. Oh, no. We dropped a piece. It's a Brick Attack video. It's got some Duplo. I think it was Duplo that hit the ground. What'd you get, dude? I got a honey pot and shark and a Hot Wheels car and a little and, and, and a dog. Somebody knows you well that sent this. We also got some artwork here. Is this supposed to be Clark Man? Yeah. That looks exactly like you if it is. And then we've got the Brick and Tech Journey logo on the back. Clark is doing the unbagging. Very cool artwork. And I think we've got a letter in there too. Oh, you even got tires in there? All the things Clark loves in life. Check out this guy. Dude. They sent you like the coolest Hot Wheels ever. Yeah, here's some honey pots for me to share with my mommy and daddy. Aww. I'll read the letter here before it gets eaten by the shark. It says, to Greg and Clark, I have never sent any mail before and wanted to make you guys the first. I had included some things for Clark to play with and two honey pots, AKA lollipops in the UK. Please say hello to me uh, and my mom and dad and sausage dog buddy as this will make me so happy. Love from the UK. Thanks in advance from Oliver Swift, aged eight from the UK. P.S. My mom's name is Sam and dad's name is Adam. So Oliver, Sam, Adam, thank you guys so much for the letter. Thank you for the shark. Thank you for all the cool stuff in here. <laughs> he's, he's got a death grip on there. No, no. Thank you for the cool artwork here, man. I really appreciate that. Clark is now on the table, but can we give a huge thank you to Oliver? Thank you, woo! If you guys didn't know, I think you all do. I save all the letters that we get. Shark got it. Now on to the package stack here, and we're gonna start out with this one. Thank you, Mr. Shark. I'm trying to cut into this one. You guys are crazy with the packages sometimes. Need help? Yeah, I can. I open all things. Thank there you are, sir. Honey pot for Clark, man. What kind is that? Oh, cool. And this is orange. Dude. Okay. We're into the next one here. Nice little letter on top. Hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. When they put the letter on top, we read the letter first. Yeah. <laughs> this says, Dear Greg and Clark, my name is Daniel Pham, and I enjoy your videos every day. 
That was your cue. Mm -hmm. Where's the every day? Every day! Every time someone sends a letter with every day, I need you to go every day. It'll be like a thing that we do. What do you think? Not great. Not great? Okay, we won't do that then. I always can't wait for the notification of a new video from you. I like your enthusiasm and how you keep it real. I'm now living my childhood collecting and building Lego. I included a set that I saw you wanted, which I purchased from the Legoland Discovery we had near us. Thank you for the awesome videos and keep up the great work. Sincerely, Daniel Pham. P.S. I also included some extra goodies. I'm assuming that's for the Clark man. So let's find out what Daniel included. First things first. We got another one of these guys. I uh, got two. Oh. Are you kidding me right now? I have a feeling what's inside these. We happen to have four of these here. I don't know with certainty, but uh, there's some things that I want. And, oh, dude. Thank you so much, Daniel. I was going to buy this for $20. And. You sent this to me. Thank you so much, dude. I love this. If you guys haven't seen this set, this is the Lego Land Castle. Uh oh. Clark man just got a whole bunch more honey pots. Daniel. Daniel. Bad Daniel. <laughs> Bad Daniel. You're sending too much sugar, <laughs> you guys. We have an entire, I, what is it, a gallon bag of honey pots blueberry. upstairs. <laughs> this blueberry. But, dude, thank you so much for this. Should we open these up now? Yeah. I think what we're going to do, I'm going to make a special edition mini fig Monday just for these four openings. Because I just have this feeling that Daniel, Daniel knew what he was doing here. So we're going to open those up. This, I got another one of these. It's tough when we get mail all at the same time. I got to figure out what to do with the second one because I don't need two Iron Mans. I do say you can't have enough Lego. I could give one to Clark or if Daniel's okay with it. We could do something fun and give this away. Is that Iron Man? It is, yeah. I always talk about when we get duplicates and I feel bad like taking a gift and giving it away. But if I can make something, somebody happy with this, it'd be kind of cool, right? Mm -hmm. Maybe there's another Clark out there watching and he's like, my Walmart, just like my Walmart, never had these ever. Maybe we can make that little Clark Man's day. Anyway, Daniel, thank you so much for sending this to us. Thank you for the Disney mini fingers and thank you for the poly bag. You are the man. I'm glad you're enjoying the videos and we're enjoying making them. So thank you so much for that. Trying to stay organized here. So I'm gonna try to set this stuff off to the side and we're gonna go on to the next package here. This one is from our friend, Brick Whiz. Yeah, I'm putting my honeypot in there. You put your honeypot in the box? Mm. Um, okay. <laughs> Do you know what kind of videos that Brickwiz makes? Hmm. He makes Star Wars videos. Mm -hmm. Who's your favorite Star Wars character? Um, Stormtrooper from Dark Vader. This one, I should be honest, I already kind of knew it was in here because Matt messaged me on Instagram and he was like, I have these duplicate sets. Would you be interested in them? And I said, absolutely we would be because what's our motto? You can never have too much Lego, right? And Matt was very generous. Matt is Brickwiz, by the way. I'm gonna link his channel up top. He makes some really great Star Wars videos. If you're into Star Wars, I know we might have a few people that aren't super triggered that stuck with us. Oh, there's something else in here too that Clark Man's interested in. They're hot raw, they're red Yeah, okay, I'll show this since Clark Man kind of spoiled it. This is Lego Technic set 42072, whack. Here's a look at the back. You can build this into some massive equipment there. So there is a Lego Technic set. And of course, being that Brickwiz is into Star Wars, they've got this one here. I think we saw this at Kmart and it was like $23. <laughs> The, 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 the one she'll fall, flies off. Dude! We got two more sets in here too. We've got 75128. This is the TIE Advanced Prototype. And last but not least, we've got 75126. First order snow speeder. And what's the guy that's driving this, Clark, man? Oh, they are triggered now, boys. We also have a letter in here from Matt as well. This says, what's up, Greg and Clark? It's your boy, Matt. Hope you're doing well. Figured I'd send some of my order sets to you guys to have fun with. Enjoy them. Hope to see you both very soon. Maybe I'll catch you at the next m &R podcast and hopefully Brick Fair Virginia 2019. Clark, man, listen to your parents and eat your vegetables. Words of advice from Brick Whiz. Much love from Matt. Matt, thank you so much for the letter. Thank you for sending us your your duplicates or older sets that you had. We will certainly have a lot of fun with these. There will be triggered Star Wars fans on this channel with all these stormtroopers flying about. And the cool thing about these ships is that we can build these all up and have maybe our own little Star Wars battle. Maybe a destruction derby. What do you think, Clark, man? Right. That was my idea. Destruction derby featuring all these sets. We'll just start smashing them together and see what comes about. Are you trying to scare me? Oh, you're yeah. trying to show me your tongue? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's very pink. Can you give a huge thank you to Brickways for sending all this stuff, dude? Thanks. 
Boom. And you're gonna eat your vegetables? No. Next one here is a priority box. What's that sound like? Lego. You think? <gasps> oh, dude. Oh, dude. Somebody's been watching our videos because we got Steve, aka Sourcrap. Is that his name? Was that his old name, Sourcrap? The buildable figure, or finger, if we're calling him that. And we also got Alex, which is really cool. And. And chicken! And there's. Oh, of course. Yeah, I mean, the most important part of this the chicken, obviously. I mean. If you didn't know that, you're not a Minecraft detector. And last but not least, who's this guy, Clark, man? Um, I don't know. The skeleton. The skeleton. You knew that. This is the one that Clark man wanted. I showed him pictures of both of these, and he was like, I want the skeleton. So I must have said Skellington. We're getting back into Skelling. <laughs> Skellington. We're getting into there. Skeleton. But yeah, we've got all three of these guys. And now I just have this idea after Yay! getting Matt's package. I have this idea that I just want to battle all this stuff. So we might end up doing a Minecraft Battle Royale to see who the last survivor is if these guys all fight. This could be a new thing on our channel, especially with Mr. Destructive over here. I, I, oh, his, their, their arms move. Yeah. If these guys fought in a battle, who do you think would win? Um, this guy. You think Steve would win? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. Put your bets in, folks. Who's going to win in our Minecraft Detector Battle Royale? This guy's yeah, they do. I'm going to show these off to you. I'm sure most of you have seen these. We're a little behind the times when it comes... Oh my goodness. We're behind the times when it comes to Lego stuff, but they can sit. They can move their arms. They come with... Uh, I don't want to say... I'm going to say Wepoons. Hopefully YouTube doesn't catch me on that. Wepoons. Yeah, it's not the other thing that we wouldn't say. And then there is a parrot. I had someone say on one of my videos that they bought this just for the parrot, which I thought was great. And I realized they were now zoomed in like crazy. So yeah, that's really cool. Um, there's a letter in here. I should have probably <laughs> got a little bit sooner. This says, Dear Greg and Clark, it's Zach. Again, Zach. Zach is sending us mail like every week at this point. In fact, Zach was the person that sent the poly bag for the flower that we did on Wednesday. I, I said I'd be sending you something else bigger and here it is. I saw your Minecraft video and then found these for $5 each. Are you kidding me, dude? $5? You got these for $5 each. Clark's like, I don't know money. Uh, usually $13. I'm going to Brick World in Columbus, Ohio, Memorial Weekend, so I'll keep my eyes peeled for more awesome deals. Thanks for the awesome videos every day. Every day. Are we gonna make this a thing? I feel like uh, it needs to happen naturally. I can't be like, every day, and then, how are we gonna do this? Every butt. Uh, we're not gonna do every butt, I don't think. But we'll figure this out, we're gonna do a thing. Zach, thank you once again for the mail. You are way too generous to us. We actually met Zach in person. Do you remember meeting Zach at Philly Brickfest? Mm -hmm. It's really cool to meet people that watch our videos. It's cool when we get letters from them and stuff like this. And it's really awesome, Zach, that you did this for us because this creates a whole series of videos for us. And I think a lot of fun too. So thank you so much for that, Zach. Can you give like the most ginormous thank you to Zach that we've ever given anyone in the history of Brickitect? Thank you! Let's move on to the next package here. This one looks like it had a bit of a rough time at some point in its travel. The mailman was like, let me try to put this in the mailbox. And that's what happened right there. But hopefully what's inside is, is okay. We're in. Okay, all right, the first thing we got here is the letter and the missing tread. I remember this person mentioning that, and this is from Cat God. Asked me a couple times if I got their package. We got it, Cat God. I'm gonna leave that on there for now just so it doesn't get lost. But this says, I tried to include everything you like. By the way, don't read my letter in letter text. Do it in mail time. You send a package like this, of course it's in mail time, my friend. We've got his letter here. Cat God's letter, along with some, looks like, insects and there's some lizards and such down there at the bottom. Dear Greg and Clark, I have accomplished your dare to send you a spare tread piece, the one you didn't have in the yard sale set. Did I make that a dare? But while I'm at it, I also am sending monster trucks, Hot Wheels, stickers, pieces to throw, not to drop, wheels to put together, random minifinger parts, your guys Sig Fig, Lego set 60053, complete with no box, and sticky, sticky splats. Just kidding, not sticky, oh, you got me. Not sticky spots, but anything else for sure. Anyway, since I got dared by you, now it's your turn to get dared by me. Make the Q&A video. I gotta do it. Maybe give the channel, give my channel a shout out. There you go, Cat God. Look up Cat God on the YouTubes and don't get set on fire with the blue flame. P.S. Which is worse, folded manual or sticky splats? Or people will ask for shout outs. You know the answer to that one, my friend. 
But inside here, this is gonna be the package that Clark is super interested in. Very nicely packaged. Grave digger! Dude! What did I got? I got more. I think you need to open that up and see what's in there, my friend. We also got nice bubble wrap. We've got some peanuts. We've got the sig figs. An octane car because Clark Man is definitely on the octane and he should be sponsored by them when he races. Oh, little Batman! Here's the rest of the stuff that's in here, the throwing pieces, and now... Darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. That one says Bounty Hunter. Bounty Hunter. Oh my goodness. I think we're gonna be here for a while, so grab a snack and check out all Clark's new Hot Wheels monster trucks from Cat God, we, aka Satchel. We got, now we got two groups here now, two groups. You know what I say about Hot Wheels monster trucks? Yeah. You can never have too many of them. Hot Wheels cars I'm gonna here. spin these around too. Hot Wheels cars. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Sorry, I was just trying to switch them around so we could see the front of them here. There's probably some Hot Wheels detectors out there that love this stuff. Oh, is that a limo? Look at that. This looks dun, 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 dun. What do you got? That's a truck. This is an F-150 Raptor. That looks like it could go in the mud really good. And you got what? Is that a Corvette? Yeah. Dang. Cat God hooked you up with some awesome cars, man. You got a taxi. What's that one? That's a drag car? Yeah, look at this engine. I don't know if I even got that one in focus, guys. Uh, I'm doing my best engine. here. This is not easy to yeah, film. Put the button. Dun, dun. There it is. I'm gonna cr I'm gonna crush the taxi. Okay, go ahead. You can't have a brick tick video without crushing some cars, man. Yeah, I crushed it with Batman. He's going into the octane car, my friends. That's cool, man. Whee! Get out here! Oh, octane driver, RIP. We've got the Greg and Clark sig figs here. And these are the pieces to, I have to reread the letter, but I think he said these are the pieces that we're supposed to keep in the bag and never mm -hmm. throw or do anything with other than put them in our collection very nicely. <laughs> All right, go ahead and throw those for Cat God. We owe it to you, Cat God. Here it is. I don't even know where that went. Okay, that sounded painful. Oh, there's that one. All right, there you go, Cat God. I hope you enjoyed that one. Thank you so much for all the cool stuff here. I think the moral of the story here is that you guys are just way too good to us. I honestly feel like we don't deserve all of this stuff that we get. I just like making videos and I like putting them out there. Your comments are good enough, but when you guys do this for us, it's just, it's incredible, man. You make noise. Oh, you're into the peanuts now. Cat God knew. It's so cool when I see stuff like this because it's like, you can tell Cat God watches our videos. I mean, you can tell, right? There goes the Octane Car Racing. Yeah, new video series, smashing into everything on the table. Episode one, complete. Say all that to say that we still have two more packages here. These are the big bad boys. This one's from Amazon, this one's from Walmart. So let's go to Amazon first. This is heavy. I have no idea what's in here. I don't even know if this is Lego or not. It's addressed to Greg and Clark, so we'll see. Are you kidding me right now? <gasps> no way. No way. Dun, 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 Clark dun, Man just got a whole box of minis. Yeah. What Holy is... moly. Not even it. Hmm. There, they, oh. Next up, guys. My most wanted Lego set at the moment. 75258. Anakin's Pod Racer, 20th anniversary. I just love this set. I know some of you guys don't like episode one. I personally do. And I think this set is fantastic. Let's get to the letter here. Inside here. There's a whole slew of minis inside there. There is an entire care package of stuff in here for our entire family. And there are a bunch of notes as well. Let me see if I can get them all here. Clark is freaking out right now. Clark is now using the mini box as a ramp for his Hot Wheels. And while he's taking a look at that, I've got all of the <laughs> gift messages here. And I think I have them in order here to make sense because Amazon uh -oh, only gives you so daddy. much space to say something. Dad, the monster truck can fly. This says, hey, Greg and Clark, this is Spark Likes Lego. You and your family's journey on YouTube has inspired me to get closer to my own family. I'm almost 30, so I'm starting to feel the years. Yeah, I know that. See next gift message on the other pod racer, which I just noticed we, we pulled that first pod racer out. There's actually two There's pod two. racers in here. I don't know if that was intentional or not, but we've got two pod racers. This says, you've helped me become closer with my pap who's on hospice. So I've been enjoying building a few sets here and there. Finally, set 601 minifinger brick separator every day. He's a toad, Jenny, stormtrooper. You're all great. All the brick tech memes are on there. Uh, it says, 
I tried to find something Clark would like, Thomas related, but I couldn't find anything that would have the same enjoyment as opening these mystery minis. Absolutely. I'm going to do a whole video, probably on Greg's world, because that's where all of our Thomas enthusiasts are. We'll open every single one of those all in one shot. That'll be really cool. Uh, the next one is for Mrs. Brickitect, and it says, So Mrs. Brickitect proved to be the most difficult person to shop for, but I remember she's a teacher. And well, if she doesn't like tea or coffee, this will at least hold her pens or something. She definitely likes coffee. I think this is for her. I don't think she's going to mind me opening this up for her, just so you guys can see what's inside here. But this is a teacher coffee mug, and this says, Mentor, inspire, educate, coach, share, influence, and encourage. How cool is that? And become a teacher. And I'm going to put this over here to keep it very safe because Clark Man will break it. Where was I here in the messages? This says, these are all natural and the, and the name is awesome. I think this is the one for Roxy Bear. And this is Rocco and Roxy brand jerky sticks. She's going to go crazy. You're going to find out in a second, but first we've got to talk about Mellow Cat's gift. This is hopefully Mellow Cat likes these, tried to pick something all natural. And these are Blue Wilderness soft moist cat treats and she will definitely like these and Roxy probably will too because anytime I put a few out Mel will eat one or two and then Roxy comes in she's like Ow! speaking of Roxy going out let's try these out these are for Roxy bear that's for doggies and cat nope just dogs these are jerky sticks and uh, let's see if she's interested do you think she's interested in yeah, these I wanna see her one. you want to give her one mm -hmm. okay these are pretty big so she's probably just gonna have one. Oh. Yikes! I tried to capture that, but uh, she went, she went, and it's it's gone, it's gone already. This is Roxy's time. Do you want another one, Boo Bear? Yes. Yes, please, Dad. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna feed her this one. Okay, sit, sit, speak, 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 speak. Good girl. Do you guys want to see the destruction? Be <laughs> choking up. Oh my goodness. Roxy's magic tricks. How to make a jerky stick disappear in one second. In Roxy's tummy. Okay, I think that's probably enough for right now. We could probably do this all day with Boo Bear. Yeah. Can you say thanks to Spark Likes Lego for your treats, Roxy Bear? Thank you. <laughs> and what do you say to Spark Likes Lego for all these cool minis? Thank you. Roxy has never been more interested in mail time in her entire life. <laughs> <laughs> and for me, Spark Likes Lego, thank you so much for everything you've done for us. That last live stream we did, you made a very substantial donation, which I really appreciate. All these goodies here. Let me know on this, I'm assuming you're watching this video, let me know uh, what the story is behind the two of these. I just need one. Could this be a giveaway, possibly? Maybe there's a gift receipt that I missed because there's a lot there. And maybe it's just because there's a kid grabbing all over me. But let me know on this. I'll definitely build one and then maybe give away. What do you think? This guy way. Listen, this is life lesson from Brickitech to his son and maybe to anyone else out there. Coming close for this one. This is going to be a message, and this is important for everybody to know. The more you give, the more you get. And that is the message of this channel, right? Like, we put out there, I don't make videos with the expectation of getting things from people. If you put your heart and soul into something and you're passionate about it and you make stuff that people like or they appreciate you, this is what comes out of it. So, if we give this away, the more we give, the more we get, Clark, okay? No matter what that is in life, whether it's respect, money, whatever it is you're seeking, that's the way it works. And I know this message means nothing to you, but maybe somebody out there that's watching this will appreciate it. Moving on from Greg's words of wisdom to the last package from Walmart. I said earlier in this video, I was trying to keep this table nice and that kind of stopped happening after a while. I hope there's, there's some, some gumballs in here. Gumballs? Yeah. That would be really random. Yeah, we have a gumball I wouldn't rule it out, though. We do have a gumball machine now. Yeah, we got the, I hope there's gumballs in here. I gotta be very careful what we say, though, because you know what'll happen in the next video, Clark? What? There'll be 40 packages of gumballs from all these different people because we said that. So oh. don't send us gumballs, folks. Clark, don't. We'll, we'll take care of it. Clark, don't eat gumballs. No, you gotta be careful with those. Holy moly. moly! Somebody, sent, somebody sent a monster truck truck. What in the world it's, is that all about? That's for monster trucks. That is for monster trucks for you to carry. Dang, Hot Wheels monster truck carrier. How appropriate is this gift? How many monster trucks I have to carry on here? We have to find out right yeah, now. Let me show the one other thing that's in here, and 
Oh, there's no letter. We've got ourselves a 75237 yeah. TIE Fighter attack. This mail time is proving to me, and this makes me so happy that the Star Wars attackers are still with us. I love that. Look at all this Star Wars oh, stuff. Yeah. Look, we didn't, we didn't get Tiger Shark. We didn't uh oh. Get, we are didn't... we gonna have to get Tiger Shark? Yeah, there's Tiger Shark right there. See Tiger Shark right there? Okay, there's Tiger Shark, everyone. Look at this thing, though. Yeah, it's a monster truck that carries monster trucks. Yeah, oh, there's, there's Loco Punk in their delivery. That is so meta, isn't it? Yeah, I can't keep. I want to open it. I thought this is the letter. This is from the last package, which was from Spark Likes Lego. Sugar Shack. I want to know who sent this to us. Oh man, did it get lost somewhere? No, no. This is so perfect for us. I just want to know who I can thank for this because obviously we needed this, right? I think I've got all of these monster shucks on to him. I think you have to. Okay, so these things are what secure him in there. And you just got to turn those, okay? I'm turning it. Yeah, so. you just turn those around and it pops out. Turn that. Oh! We gotta get these things out of here. What are those? Those things like hold them into place. And. Flip them over. And. Oh, that thing comes down. And this will rip out of there. Let me bring you guys down here to take a look at this thing. Dang! Yeah, how, how I load them on top. Uh, they, you, oh, oh. Oh, we gotta cut that, eh? Edward Scissorhands to the rescue. It should come down now. There you go. Boom, right up the back. Lift up. Yep, lift it up. And then he's up there. Clarky's gonna do the impossible. Fill this thing with all kinds of monster trucks that are all now all over the floor. Speaking of floors, look at this place, guys. Look at this place. I, I mean, my ever monster trucks. Anything. Go get the rest of your collection. Let's see how many we can get on this thing. Here comes some. <laughs> uh, here's Dan delivering Hot Wheels and Alien Beijing. And, uh, and the best one ever, Spider Man. It's the greatest. I'm going to do a poll up top right now. Who is more excited about their gift? Roxy Bear and the Jerky Sticks or Clark Man and the Monster Trucks? Leave it up top. I think you got enough there, boss. Let's load them up and see if they fit. All right. Look at that, man. Here, I got more. We got more. No worries. We've got six up top. There are four on the bottom down here. He closed the back up. And now this thing rolls by itself too. I really would love to know who sent this to us because this is just awesome. And I'm gonna feel so bad if there was a message somewhere in there. But if there was, I didn't see it. Driving off with monster trucks. When I started mail time like a year and a half ago, I had no idea it would ever turn into what you're seeing right here. I had lots of people back in the day asking me, open a PO box, open a PO box, open a PO box. I finally did it. And ever since then mail has been coming in and I think this week is probably the biggest mail time that we've ever had. And I want to thank you guys so much for everything you do for us. It really does help when you send us stuff like this because this allows us to make videos and create content for you guys. So like that's a video, that's a video. This is maybe a giveaway. Let me know, Spark. This is a Battle Royale video. There's another Smash Up video. Like there's all this stuff here. That's a video, this is a video. Like it just allows me to create so much stuff and allows the backlog to stay intact for just that bit longer because we still have stuff in here. I have just been so short on time lately with everything that's going on. Plus I'm taking two days a week to go yard sailing, which I love to do. It's one of my favorite things. And we're gonna get through this stuff. If you send us something in mail time that we haven't gotten to yet, I am doing my best. It's just oh, busy, busy times guys. But this is really cool. I love you guys for doing this for us. It's just amazing. How I unload these top monster trucks. Uh, You just pull this down right here. Ready? They're all gonna fly off. We're gonna keep playing around here, of course. Clark, man, you wanna send them out? Thanks for watching. Oh.